Hi Libra, welcome. I'm here to do a reading for you for the month of February. And I've already pre-shuffled the oracle cards and pulled them out for you. So please only take with you what resonates and leave the rest behind. Let's go ahead and talk about these and then we'll get into the tarot. Here it's talking about you being between worlds, which could be this in-between time where you know, you're know you leaving something, going to something else, making changes in your life, that sort of thing. And you see how it's kind of dark and then it goes into this vivid color. It's possible that you're feeling a challenge by getting into the space, but you need to make the most of this that's possible. Okay, it can be a beautiful time. And that's something that I really think you need to create is this beautiful in-between time. And here, to the sea, it can talk about feeling kind of alone. But changing that over into where you're in the flow with the universe. So to me, this kind of goes in with your in-between worlds quite well. Yeah, so you might start out feeling a little alone, um, a little bit of challenge, but work it to where it is beautiful and that you're in the flow and happy. And here it's saying that you are poised, you are ready for this new beginning. You're ready to get something started. And here you have the koi fish spirit. There is always enough. So if you are feeling anywhere in here where there isn't, do know there is always enough. And actually there's more than enough, okay? You're transforming out of an energy and into something new and beautiful. And you can see that you're in this in-between time, you know, creating change. Here, you're finding your way to be in flow with the universe. Here, you're ready to start something new, right? So this transformation is coming in and it is going to be beautiful. And here it's finally saying, let it shine. The peacock spirit, let yourself shine. You have put in the work to get here. Let it be known. Okay. Now let's go ahead and see what the tarot would like to share. Yeah, those are some really beautiful energies. It's saying you are so ready to transform into that peacock spirit and to be in flow with the universe. And this one I actually love because it's saying, you know, transform yourself from kind of a lack energy into something that's so exciting and so beneficial for you. Let me see what number this is, 48. Okay, I'm just curious. Okay, let's see what the overall energy is for you during this time. It makes perfect sense. This is where you are creating an ending. It is a Ten of Swords. There could be, you know, here you can kind of see it maybe at the beginning of here you can see it where there might be challenging emotions. But there is a part of you that knows this transformation is going to lead to something beautiful. So you are letting go of whatever either isn't or quit serving you to go forward and have this transformation into something beautiful. Okay? Now let's take a look at the past. Ah, you started this in the past. Definitely. This is where you're leaving behind where you've been to go for your happiness just fits in beautifully. Your current energy at this moment is a new beginning. One where you are thinking clearly, seeing clearly, using your wisdom, having the way of knowing. Like if there was a veil before, it is gone. You are now able to see so clear that you know how to go forward. Unconditional love. Absolutely beautiful. Mm-hmm. And 
Okay, I love this. This is happiness. Much happiness for you. Here is your desires. You want this unconditional love. You want the happiness. And this is either help or obstacles, which is obviously a help. This is saying you're going to be so very happy. You want the unconditional love and the happiness. And it is coming in. And now the outcome, the future, is it could be a few different things. One, it could be saying you might need to use some strategy. So it might very well be that you need to plan this out. Okay? And at the bottom of the deck, oh yeah, you're dropping all of the burdens. Whatever was in the past, you're dropping all the burdens that come from that. And it could be potentially some lingering energy from the past where you start out, you know, in the not greatest of emotional, mental um, energies, right? But when you drop those burdens, it all starts to change. And that's what you're doing. You're dropping them. So that is beautiful. When you drop the burdens, it makes you feel like a hundred pounds lighter. You know, and then the, you can feel the hope returning. The belief returning. It, it's a wonderful feeling. Okay, let's clarify. See what comes up in your past. Okay, that's a saying you're putting in the effort that it takes to go forward. You are finally honing something, which brings me to these two as well. You know, you're starting on something and creating this beautiful thing, whatever it may be. Yeah, so this is just kind of confirming this and saying, yeah, you know, in order to achieve what you want, you've got to make this change. So you are. <laughs> yeah. Your current energy for this time, new beginning in clarity and wisdom and thought is bringing much happiness for, the, for those you care about and for yourself. Your desires are to not look back, to not go back into where it's darker and grayer. You don't want to. You want to go forward and be in this unconditional love. Beautiful. Okay, now you have more help. This is saying that you're going full circle. You know, you started a cycle and now you're completing that cycle and having this new beginning, right? You're transforming into something wonderful and new. And it also says this is a time to be proud of yourself because you have gone full circle. You've lived through it, completed it, it's done. So be proud of yourself and allow all that happiness to come in. Okay, here you have the Page of Pentacles, which is saying you're ready to get it started. Whatever this is, you are ready to go forward. And here it's saying you might need to use strategy so you get the best outcome in the best timing possible. Okay? And at the bottom of the deck, you have... Let's see if you can see that. Let's get it over long. Yeah. You have the Six of Pentacles balance. By you dropping the burdens... You're bringing in this beautiful balance. And it's also saying whatever you need is going to be provided to you. All right? To help bring in the balance. So that is just beautiful. Okay, let's go ahead and see what the universe would like to share. Yeah, I think this is a wonderful reading and extremely transformative. So you're going from, for lack of a better term, a dark place into something that is going to make you extremely happy where you can shine your light. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. 
<laughs> Love it. You have the star. Okay, this is saying your wishes are coming true. What it is that you've been planning and working towards is coming true. And it's also saying if at any point you need any healing from whatever happened in the past where it was darker, it's here for you. Okay? Unconditional love, which is what you have in your desires. The universe is confirming that. It is coming in, this unconditional love, this, and it's beautiful. And it can be with another. It could be anybody. It could be romantic. It doesn't have to be. It could be with yourself. But it is coming in, unconditional love. Absolutely wonderful. Another new beginning. This is the one where your cup runneth over with love. Unconditional love and love. And seen clearly. Wow. Gorgeous reading. And here, <laughs> the Six of Wands, this is where victory is yours. So, going through all this, starting out in this dark place, you're ending up victorious. And you have supporters in this. It's wonderful. Okay. Let's see what the angels would like to share. Yeah, it's a beautiful reading. Mm-hmm. Meditation brings answers. So something that would benefit you during this time is to take the time to meditate. That will help you. If you have any questions... Take the time to go within, get still, and think about what it is that you need help with. It will come. And it's also saying, take action. Now is the time to go forward with what it is you want. So it's beautiful. If you like this reading, please give it a like, share, subscribe. It all truly helps the algorithm which is outside my understanding but it does okay let's close this out with the charm you have a multi-tool all right this one always perks my interest what this is saying is whatever you need you're gonna find a way to create it, to be able to use it, to achieve your goal. So that to me that means you're really creative, innovative. You can figure out whatever it is that you need to do to help you achieve your goal. Okay? Thank you so much. Much love. Bye.